rendang. Such a rich and comforting dish, one that is always synonymous with Malaysian cuisine. But what is rendang, I hear you say? Rendang is a dish slow cooked in coconut milk with karisik, which is toasted coconut, added at the end to enrich it, making it the comforting and wonderful dish that it is. Rendang is voted one of the top 10 things to eat before you die. Rendang, like many foods in Malaysia, has many varieties. Rendang daging, which you know it as beef rendang. We have chicken rendang. We have rendang hati, which is a liver rendang. And then we also have the vegetarian version. We have jackfruit rendang. We have rendang fish. So there are many, many varieties of rendang. Then, in every region in Malaysia has its own rendang version too. I have taken the core spices of the rendangs that I know and love and make it into this recipe that is easily created by you in your home kitchen. Rendang traditionally is a laborious dish to make and therefore it's a celebration dish, a dish that is worth the effort to celebrate something special. So we always have rendang during Eid, which is Hari Raya in Malaysia. Jackfruit, if you haven't had that before, is quite meaty. It resembles a bit of like shredded meat. But I think it has its own character. I love the texture of jackfruit and pair with the sweet potato, they both wrap the rendang paste really well and has a life of its own. The first time I have tried jackfruit is at my friend Jackie Kearney's book launch. She has traveled extensively throughout Southeast Asia and has written a vegan book. I thought, what a wonderful idea to use jackfruit. So I have adapted my rendang recipe to add jackfruit to give texture and add sweet potato to balance out the spiciness. And it works incredibly well as a vegetarian option. Mm -hmm. 